all right everyone welcome back another day out here trash picking once again i am pretty sore but we're gonna make do It's actually expensive one, but it's got like really disgusting stuff inside, so I don't want to be transporting any sorts of bugs. And this thing, I'm not sure if it's for like. For uh, clams. Beach, maybe? I don't know. That right there is actually a train, uh, not a train, a uh, train track, and it's like covered. It's, I don't know why it's covered, but it is. That television has probably been out here for a year and a half. Lonely, lonely chair. I guess a lot of people just replace their whole door when things like this happen. I've heard it's not that difficult to replace a screen, but if you don't want to replace a screen, you don't replace the screen. Must fit a very large door. I don't know why, but I felt like I might have needed this at some point. This thing is full of all sorts of stuff. Shape items. So this is from that uh, that corn I helped the lady out with. Odd shaped items are not easy to stack. You can always count on one of these. It's not a mattress. These people always had a bunch out back in the day. Uh, I don't know what that is. We'll, we'll take a look. Oh, it's all like construction debris. with the others. They, they always throw out a ton of, uh, paneling or flooring. That stuff in the back. There's more on their back porch also. Like, whatever this stuff is. Subflooring, maybe? Um, and then up there was where I found that really nice, uh, advertisement piece last week. Which, with a little bit of, which with a little bit of re research, was uh, apparently from Allentown. I don't have anything this week. Got a little welcome mat. 
home for a little walk. Oh, what? Since I don't really like go around and like look in everyone's trash can, I'd probably miss out on a lot of stuff like this. Which isn't anything like exciting. Sign to me because it's it's like that's it's probably five dollars scrap price what they are right now maybe four dollars but I saw this chair popping out but was it well I wasn't really expecting to find this. Nice open spot right here. See how much energies I have. Because I am mentally and physically fried right now. Looks like probably yard sale leftovers. Let's see, <laughs> definitely what it is. Actually, a really nice tin this Pennsylvania one. This other one's old. This one might be old. It doesn't have a barcode on the bottom, which some of them usually do. I'm thinking this is probably 80s or late 70s. something else in there. Hold on. Hold on. The reason why I think this is yard sale leftovers is because they have this table out in the front yard. This is what I thought it was. Grab that too. I don't know if that that bin's probably trash, right? Been. It's a good bin. There's a Woolrich jacket in there. I don't know the shape on it, but I figured it's probably decent. Okay, so I'm gonna head up here into the really nice area of this town. I mean, these houses are gorgeous up here. This person, is this stump still out here? It is. This person put that, uh, <laughs> that stump out there a long time ago and it has just been there they put a free sign on it no one took it <laughs> who's gonna take a stump you know what that's one of the things like if you can't get rid of it out here how are you gonna get rid of a stump especially the garbage company isn't like you can't like start a fire in town crazy oh. I think it is. 
This might be one of the ones that have like the little awning on top. This thing is massive. Why is laying this like this? That's shoulder height. Some of these have like an awning that you put over it, which is nice. Like if you go to an auction, I mean, you're that guy. But if it's hot or it starts to rain a little, you don't have to be that guy and put up like an umbrella. All to find myself one of these. Another grill. It must be a uh, grill day. Six. Thought grill day was like a month ago, but I guess uh, it's still going strong. I think it might be brass, but I came out here for this chair. It's a very nice chair. It needs a lot of work. Not sure what I'd do with one chair. This one's not too bad, but I don't really know much about it. I don't know what that bag thing is on the back side. Is that like a punching bag? Like a square punching? Not even sure. Not too sure of that one. Alright, well, stopped off here at Walmart. I had to get a uh, bug spray for these crickets that are in my basement and uh, in my barn. It's just like they pop everywhere. Speaking of popping, this thing popped down. Uh, but we got a lot of metal today. It's another metal day. I drove by uh, two people who had trucks outside filled with scrap metal. So I assume those were people who went out yesterday. And then this is what I found in the morning. Uh, it seems like in the morning there's really not that many people out. But then again, there's just not that many people out. As you see, we're at Walmart. And parking lots like a fifth of the, a fifth of the way full, so everyone's still snoozing, I guess. Early bird gets to warm. Oh, sounds like we got plates in here. What do you got? Oh, oh wow. Well, good thing I grabbed this. So we got this. That old, well, this is an old Woolrich jacket. That's what I thought I saw. Old photos, old personal photos. And then this might be, is this a military jacket? Sure looks like it. It's gotta be, wow. for a Hall of Fame quarters? You know, just, you know, military stuff found in the trash. That looks like World War II era. All right, well, huh. all right. Had some personal information on it, so I'm not gonna show too much, but. All right, you never know what you're gonna find in the trash. Really never know. We got some history in here. We got a nice tote also. I mean, good, great, you got a $40 jacket, but you also have a $3 tote. Also known as a bin. 
I call these things totes because they literally say tote on them. I used to call them bins, but apparently they have their own name. However, that was another fun day of treasure hunting. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys enjoyed the video, hit the like button. Subscribe down below for more treasure hunts just like this. You never know what you'll really find in the trash. And I'll catch you guys next time, next adventure. Who knows what we'll get into until next time. Have a great day. Keep living a dream. Peace.